good? Noah here, back at it again with another little informational nutrition video. This one is about rice. Now find out what about rice in the video, but first I need you guys to smash that like button now. 25 likes. Let's do it. I know you can. 25 likes for some epic rice. It rhymes, so you better like it. Let's hit this video. So I've been doing this wrong for years. I'm pissed, this wall. Looking at you now. I have been weighing my rice wrong for years. I always was under the impression that you had to weigh your rice out cooked, not dry. It's wrong because of two main factors. The time alluded to cook your rice and the amount of water that you are using that is absorbed into the rice. Both these key components interfere and... Uh, they change the caloric value of your carbohydrate intake of that rice and of the weight. So, to properly weigh out your rice, you have to do it this way. You take out your bag of rice, you look under the direction, you just say 46 grams or whatever, how many grams dry is like one fourth a cup. You take that number and you, let's just say for this bag of rice, it's 48 grams is a serving, so let's say you want 8 servings of that. So for me, I'm doing 8 meals of 2 cups of 46 grams of rice. So 2, two meals a day for the next 8 days, or for the next 8 meals, are going to have 46 grams of carbs in them from this white basmati rice. So how I did that was, I took the amount of grams that was equivalent to 46 grams uh, of carbohydrates, which was, I think, 57.2 grams of uncooked rice. I times that by 8, okay? And I got 460 grams of uncooked rice. I believe that's right. I weighed out... 460.4 grams of white basmati rice, and then I put in the allowed amount of water into my rice cooker. And then what you do after it's done cooking is you transfer all the rice back into another bowl and you re-weigh it all back out into on your scale. And that should give you a grand total number of how much your white rice weighs, right? Simple. So, after that, then you divide that final number on your scale of the cooked white rice, and you divide it by however many meals you are trying to consume. For me, I'm doing eight meals. So I will divide my final total number by eight, and that'll determine how many grams per meal I will have for rice that it equals 46 grams of carbohydrates, okay? I know that sounded confusing. You may have to re-watch this over and over again to kind of understand that, but there's also one more rule you have to learn to always use a rice cooker. Rice cookers make rice perfectly every time, and it, it makes everything better. Plus, when you're using a rice cooker, make sure to use your rice cooker cup it is very important that you use this to scoop in and to scoop in the water because if you don't, it'll just come out all weird. Trust me, I've tried it. So that is how you weigh out your rice. Uh, uncooked. Make sure you weigh it out uncooked. For protein and chickens and steaks and stuff, that loses water weight. So if you have a six ounce piece of uncooked chicken, yeah, that's going to shrink down to around 4 ounces of, un of cooked chicken once it loses all the water retention. So always cook your proteins after it's cooked. Cook your vegetables after, before, it doesn't really matter. 
um, and cook your rice drop before you cook it and then re-weigh it after you cook it and then divide it out. That is how you cook rice properly. I know it's confusing. Uh, if it's not confusing, I'm just slow to the party. My bad, but from now on, I will be doing it this way because this is the correct way as well. I will only be eating basmati rice. Actually, I probably won't only be eating this, but I'm on this new basmati rice kick. It also is the lowest in the glycemic index. It's at 50, number 57 um, of white rices. My favorite rice has got to be jasmine rice. Even though rice is just rice, um, it's not really just rice. I know, I know, I know. But basmati rice is the healthiest alternative of white rice. So, with that being said, I hope this got helped you guys understand how to cook rice correctly. I may be uploading another video because this may not have been as clear as I wanted it to be. So, this helped. Stay tuned for more reviews on products. Stay tuned for more daily uploads, vlogs, challenges of all sorts. I went to Fuddruckers the other day and they have a three pound burger challenge that I might conquer some weekend when I'm feeling up to it and I'm not a bitch. So let's hit it. I know I'm ready. Are you ready? Let's do it. My name is Noah. Subscribe to my channel right here. Check out my most recent video here. And we are.